Go ahead. What's good, man? You feel know I me? Mean? This is the first um, Facebook reality show. Nay Marley, Joe Marley, you feel know I me? Mean? Motherfucking, we gonna um, we gonna touch on a couple of topics. For one, we gonna get on that Blueprint Three first. You feel know I me? Mean? Me personally, I'm rolling with American Gangster, man. I think American Gangster was a colder album, pointer, point blank, man. You feel know I me? Mean? What you think, Joe? He ain't had no hard album to me since the Black Album. Personally, I'm a Black. Reasonable album, doubt, you feel know I me? Mean? Reasonable doubt. Well, that was his best album, but I'm saying since his, you know, quote-unquote retirement, I feel like the Black Album was, you know, his album. Hey, man, let me touch on this. I know y'all freshmen be drinking and everything, but y'all can't out drink me. We can have a drink of thine. I don't do, I don't do personals. I don't do pints. I don't do fists. I do gallons, you feel me? I'm sober right now. That's why this is a very special um, premiere, you feel me? Because I'm sober. The next one. All the next episodes, I'm drunk. I'm on. We in the building. You feel me? We going, man. We drinking gallons. You feel me? Nothing less. Nothing less. That nigga ain't playing. <laughs> that nigga ain't You playing. catch me sober, it's hard. that's a good and hard day. You feel me? Oh, yeah. We're going to see Toy Story 1 and 2 and 3D on everything. You feel me? We're going to see that. Fade it. <laughs> we going to the haunted houses, the cemeteries, all that Halloween. Fade it. Not, I mean, not fade I'm sorry. Wasted. You feel me? Remember we passed ways. Passed, passed out. out. Yeah, we passing out now. You we feel passing me? out. Now. Oh yeah, you bitches stop getting niggas your number if you ain't got unlimited text messaging. You unlimited text now. messaging. If you can't call me whenever you feel like it, or if you got a boyfriend and you feel like you cheating on him, if you talking to me, I don't want your number. And I and I, I don't even what the fuck is what a the boy? <laughs> Tell you me. You can't give a nigga your number because your boyfriend's six hundred thousand miles away. But, you feel me? But, I, a bitch told me her boyfriend was in Africa this morning and couldn't give me your number. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Then I, man, let me tell y'all a story, man. Let me tell y'all a story. This is my strip club story. So, you feel me? No, let me get to the spade first. Y'all niggas can't see me in spades, man. I'm telling you right now. You can't see me in spades. Me and my partner, Cole, my twin. This nigga no, say, we going all in. We going 10 books. I'm like, blood, we ain't going 10 books. He like, Kyle, we going 10 books. I'm like, all right. This stupid nigga lay his hand down. He had ten hearts. <laughs> Come on, blood. Ten hearts. It's called nigga. spades. It's called spades, nigga. You didn't even have a two. <laughs> but my strip club story. So, nigga, I'm asleep. It's like 11.30 at night. I'm asleep. My nigga Dane come to the house. He's like, Callie, we going to the strip club. I'm like, nah, but I got a class in the morning. The nigga like, Callie, we going. So I thought about it. I thought about Atlanta and shit. I spent all my money at a motherfucking the Blue Flame. I'm like, shit, maybe. I'm like, nah, fuck that. The nigga smacked me in the face with a free admissions pass. I had to go. So we go and shit. It was all a little white night and shit, man. I'm about to Heineken. Them niggas kicked us out. We ain't get them bitches no money. Because we don't give a fuck about... No, no, no. Oh, yeah. Y'all niggas stop looking at us stupid when we in the functions fucking shit up going dumb. That shit, that... I don't know about that jerk shit, but hypey is a movement. You feel me? It's, it's a not a motherfucking lifestyle. tradition. It's a lifestyle. It's how you feel me, how niggas talk, how niggas walk, how niggas dress... How niggas grow their goddamn hair and how we color our shit. Speaking of that, uh, Shamika did my shit. Oh, yeah, Shamika did my shit. She twist and dyed my shit, you feel me? I'm going to let JoJo tell y'all the shit story. This going to be anonymous <laughs> names, but it's really a shit story. JoJo, you run that one down. So we all faded, you know, kicking it, smoothing it at this nigga, you know, apartment. 57, check out that cribs if you haven't already. So we all smoothing it. It's me, him, of course, Vince, uh... Uh, couple man. punk rocks. Couple yeah, it was, it was a few niggas there. I don't feel like really getting the names. So, you know, we had a few guests in there, you know. Niggas, you know, a couple motherfuckers who not usually there. So, nigga, we get a motherfucker faded for the first time because motherfuckers really don't usually fuck with us and shit. But, um, so they finishing off a bottle. I wasn't drinking this shit that night because I was a little sick. Nigga, I had a swag flu. So, um, I'm just sipping on, you know, NyQuil and shit. Then... So all of a sudden, I go take a piss. Then I come out the bathroom, and the homegirl go take a uh, piss or whatever. I don't even know if she took a piss. She was in there like that. She was in there real quick. She come out like, it's shit on the toilet. We like, what? I'm like, well, I ain't shit on the toilet. I piss with the door open. And I'm like, I know it wasn't <laughs> my niggas, because I've been fucking with these niggas too long. So I'm not going to believe my niggas shit on my toilet. You feel me? Because, you know, nigga, I, I took a piss with the door open. Some niggas knew I was in there. So, we like, man, she bullshitting. She like, man, come see. So she like, look under the toilet. 
We look, walk in there, we look under the toilet. It's shit on my floor. Uh, I'm like, right. It's like, you know how a nigga be squatting and the shit like slide down the front side of the toilet, but it go to the floor? That's how the shit was. Like, it went down and it was just nasty as fuck. But the fucked up thing is, it looked like they tried to wipe it and didn't see that the shit ran under. So, like, it was shit under. Uh, so unfortunately, I'm, my nigga Vince had to pick it up. Uh, and, that, and that's real shit. But we know who did it, and she she can't come back. <laughs> she can't. I want to say her name, but we ain't fucking up reps like that. But that's real shit. She ain't coming back over. You feel me? On and then I got another story for later on that night, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. So later yeah. on that night, you know, niggas was beefing with her. You know, two females was beefing. And if you know my little nigga Shayna, she hype as fuck, son. So, you know, the bitch she beefing with, call her, you know, they going at it, wah, wah, wah. So she over here talking to the bitch like, man, that's how I do, bitch. Wah, 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 right? Man, this nigga Vince, not knowing who Shayna is, tried to calm her down, and she, bwah, fucking <laughs> slip up, bud. <laughs> he, the homie didn't get his ass whooped by no nigga on campus. None of that it shit. Was a, it was a it motherfucking was a, it was accident. accident. He was drunk, she was drunk. His co-defendant was drunk, and she hit the nigga in the lip. But yeah. it's gonna be it's gonna be straight. It's but gonna it's be all straight. good, you know. It's all good. Oh yeah, and I got a lot of homegirls, man. And y'all can't be arguing about us being robbing big. I mean, I'm robbing big with all y'all. We we all best friends. And shit is good, man. You feel me? Let me tell y'all the ego story. I met this dumb bitch. You feel me? <laughs> this bitch was singing Beyonce and shit. She walked up to me. She like, Cali, where the fuck that bitch buy an ego from? Like, what store did she get that from? I'm like, blood. I I don't know what the ego is. So I'm going with her. I'm like, blood, this bitch got a big ass bird or something. I don't know where she got that nigga. And then my little homie, he like, yeah, that bitch on tour at the every zoo in America performing that shit. You feel me? I'm like, blood, these bitches is done, man, on everything. But hey, this is my protege JoJo. You know, we got a big group of niggas. My nigga Swag, Shardy, Vince from Atlanta. You feel me? We got my twin co from Richmond. We got Shada from the city. We got G1 from the city. Pajama party this week. If in the dudes 57, if you ain't got on no pajamas, you niggas is not coming in. You gotta have on shorts, basketball shorts, sh- or basketball shorts to get admitted. You got I don't on think jeans. You have on jeans, sweats, and none of that shit. That ain't and fine. if you from Cali, you must attend because we going down. We we going like uh, 15. So our playlist feet. is getting press play, and we not stopping until the battery go dead. All right. Simple as that. Y'all niggas catch us tomorrow evening. We gonna have some stupid ass, funny ass interviews and stories. You feel me? We finna have shows, nigga. We finna have a bunch of shit. Don't even just, not even just next evening, nigga. Just throughout this whole school year, boy. We finna be having dumb ass shit. We trying to get that VH1 on that MTV deal. And I didn't say, I, I mean, I fucked up and said the journals on the crib. <laughs> <laughs> no, that nigga did not say the journals. I still don't know how he to say that shit. Yeah, Dejanero. Yeah, Dejanero, the journal, Dejanero. We fucked that pepperoni pizza up, though, man, on everything. And I'm going to fuck y'all niggas tomorrow. If JoJo might have something else to say, go ahead, man. Uh, all I got to say is, um, I got swag, folks. <laughs>